اكيد كلكم سمعتوا بالخبر اللي صار شخص عراقي ماخذ ما اذن من الشرطه السويديه قرانا اللي يسواكم ويسوى دولتكم اللي حرضتوا على هذا الشيء وخليتوا هذا الشخص يحرق قرانه واليوم انا راح احرق جوازكم وما اتشرف بحياتي ازور هذه الدوله بعد حسبي الله ونعم الوكيل على كل شخص يحرض على العنصريه ويحرض على هذه الاشياء وهذا الجواز السويدي اللي ما اتشرف بحياتي بعد ارجع للسويد وهذا جوازكم مثل ما تشوفون Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters here I've seen this Iraqi lady who is also a citizen of Sweden she has the Swedish passport but due to the protest against the Quran burn she burned the Swedish passport subhanallah what a brave girl she is she said if an Iraqi person is burning Quran in front of Iraq embassy in Sweden and the government is supporting it then she said I don't need the passport of that country she burned the Swedish passport in protest to the Quran burn subhanallah my beloved brothers and sisters Quran is the word of Allah Quran is the guide Quran is the nur Quran is the light if you love the quran you have to recite the quran you have to understand the quran you have to learn the quran you have to protect the quran you have to respect and honor the quran they cannot do any harm to islam by burning the quran the quran is in the hearts of the people allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in the quran inna nahnu nazzalna dhikra wa inna lahu lahafizun indeed we have revealed this quran and we are the ones who will protect this quran but at least we have to feel bad we have to protest we have to support we have to show respect to the quran and if anyone wants to dishonor our quran burn our quran we have to at least protest and condemn it may allah give understanding to the people may allah forgive our shortcomings and may allah give us the ability to recite the quran memorize the quran learn the quran and live by the quran Help us build a Islamic studio at www.islamicstudio.org link in the description.